What is up guys, Tabby here and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I have my first and I guess last ever box from Hagrid's Trunk. For those of you who do not know, Hagrid's Trunk announced that they are no longer doing subscription boxes. They actually rebranded everything as well. They're now known as Advanced Potions. So yeah, I'm so sad that this will be my only box from Hagrid's Trunk. I finally ended up getting to subscribe and yeah, so sad day. I don't have all of the details of why they decided to stop doing subscription boxes, but hopefully one day they will come back. I know this has been a very popular box and all of the unboxings that I've watched have been amazing. And on a completely different note, I did want to let you guys know I've still not heard anything from the two winners of my giveaway. I'll put your names up here and in the description. So if you did win, please message me on Instagram at Gryffindor Bookworm so I can send you your boxes. I'll give you guys another week to message me or I will have to pick two new winners of my giveaway boxes. So guys, please just DM me so I can send you your boxes. But without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this box. So if you're interested, keep watching and let's get into it. And since this is my first video for Hagrid's Trunk, I did just want to say I really liked the design of their boxes. I love how they designed it to where it actually looked like a trunk. But let's do a sneakity peek. Almost lost the spoiler card. So yes, this is the spoiler card. Spoilers on the back. This was traveling across the Wizarding World for the month of April and they were going to do a Snape box for May and I'm kind of sad that they're not doing it now because you guys know I love to hate Severus Snape. So I really hope somebody eventually does make a box solely based on Snape because I would totally buy it. I, I mean... I really would. But first we have a t-shirt. Let me show you guys. Oh, it's Hogwarts Express. It says all aboard Hogwarts Express. London to Hogwarts. I actually really like the design of that. That is so cute. And this t-shirt feels like good quality, very soft. Love the t-shirt, great way to start the box. Next we have the enamel pin and it is the Flying Anglia. This is an interesting pen. It is made out of responsibly sourced wood. I have to say, I'm not actually that big of a fan of it being a wood pen. I think I've just gotten spoiled with enamel pens, but it's a cute design. I like that you, we can see the outline of Harry and Ron with Hedwig in there. So yeah, I'll definitely add it um, on my pen banner with all of my other Harry Potter ones. Very different though, I've never seen that before. Next we have, it looks like to be a a iron on patch and it says night bus conductor I actually really like the card they put this on I'm kind of sad it came bent the gold foiling is everything even the back of the card is just screaming to my Niffler heart I'm honestly not the biggest fan of iron on patches pretty much everyone I've gotten has ended up in my giveaway box but I actually really like this iron on patch. So I might end up trying to get a jacket or a bag that I can start putting my iron on patches on. So yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna save the potion for last. Next would be the candle. Let's see what we got. This is a big candle and it says try wizard cup. So you guys know I'm not like the biggest fan of candles anymore because like it's the most common item in any subscription box. I legit have my little trunk here full of just candles, but I actually love this candle. The design and shape of it is so cute. And even the top has like a little dragon design. Let's give it a smell. Oh, it is blue and glittery. I do love glittery candles. And this is wood wick. Ooh, I don't know the smell of this, but it is amazing. Kind of fruity, blueberry, kind of, I, I don't know. I think this is my favorite candle I've gotten in quite a while. Just the shape, the smell, the glitter. Perfection. Perfection. And now to the star of the box, we have the potion. Now that they're not doing subscription boxes, I might end up trying to just get some of their potions from their Etsy shop. Let's see what we got. It is flu powder. Look how big this is. 
flu powder transports people to a predetermined destination best before 1999. Just a tad bit out of date. Um, <laughs> why that came out so country, I do not know. But it also says property of Arthur Weasley, 1992. I'm loving this green powder and the wax seal at the top. And it even has the price tag on here, which was two galleons. Oh, I love it. I love it. My first potion from Hagrid's Trunk or Advanced Potions. But guys, that was everything from Hagrid's Trunk. Let's take a quick look at the spoiler card. So we had the flu powder potion, travel by fireplace across the wizarding world with this nifty little potion. Remember to clearly pronounce your destination. We have the port key candle designed to look like a famous port key, the Triwizard Cup. Watch you don't get teleported to the Dark Lord. Ooh, I forgot that this was a port key. Then we had the Hogwarts Express t-shirt, one of the most famous ways of traveling in the wizarding world. Travel in style and treat yourself to something from the trolley witch. Anything from the trolley, dear? And then we had the night bus conductor patch, beautifully designed by Wizarding Workshop. Yes, I love the design. On YouTube, this amazing patch will make you the next conductor on the night bus. Then we had the Flying Ford Anglia pen. The Flying Ford Anglia was a popular choice in the Wizarding world. Remember to press the invisibility booster so you can't be seen by the muggles. So that was everything from the box. As always, you guys will have to let me know what was your favorite item, least favorite. For me, my favorite item, of course, was the potion, but I really liked the candle and the t-shirt. My least favorite item, as you guys probably know, was the pin. But overall, I'm very happy with my last box from Hagrid's Trunk. I'm so sad they're not doing these boxes anymore. I kind of want to do my own Snape special edition box because I was kind of really looking forward to that, you know? But as always, I would love to hear from you guys in the comments down below. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, hey, welcome. Feel free to hit that subscribe button if you want to join my small community of Harry Potter lovers and bookworms. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys. That reminds me of Hocus Pocus. Goodbye, cruel world. Oh my god, my nails are awful. Wow, that came out really girly. Looking at you. Okay. Lucas. Um, stupid train. Yes, we hear you. Go away. Got oh break it, Tabitha. <laughs> oh hi Boo Bear. So I'm filming at night and look who just woke up. Hi baby. Did you just wake up? Yeah. Why don't you go lay in mommy's bed, okay? I'm right here. I love you. Do you like my candle? It's sparkly. Good night. The gold foiling. You can hear Xander snoring. Tell me why for the longest time I thought it was for Angela, not Anglia, Angela. Who the crap is Angela? Who, who knows? Who, who knows? Oh, oh, who, who knows? Tell me why for the longest time I thought it was for Angela, not Anglia. Angela, does that make any sense? No, no it doesn't. I don't even know when Angela. <laughs> wow, I should not drink energy drinks before filming. Or should I? <laughs> okay, that's enough. <laughs>